In this episode of Life's Little Miracles, Kyle undergoes surgery, and Kyle's struggle with cancer continues. Fifteen-month-old Kyle Dumochel has cancer tumors on both her kidneys. She was being treated with chemotherapy when doctors decided to try to remove the tumors surgically. Everything she's had in her whole life has been so rare, and if they say there's a small margin, she just seems to keep falling in it. And... Yeah, I believe in miracles. Miracles happen. The last thing you want to do is give up. Oh, so, I know that I We'll do the best we can. And she's a little fighter. She'll pull through. Okay, we're in business. Let's go. And then there's the big tumor occupies most of the kidney. No, I think that kidney has to go. Let's go ahead and take that out. Surgeons have had to remove the entire right kidney, but hope to save most of the remaining kidney. Keep your fingers crossed. The area in the back part of the kidney that uh, looked abnormal on the MRI, and it doesn't feel abnormal, is it possible to get ultrasound to come and uh, give us a hand here? What I'd like you to do is try and define for us the borders of that area in the front wall that um, represents the, the tumor. There's, there's, there's the, the tumor there. Yeah. Anything below that is clear? Well, that's good news for her. So if we go two and a half by two and a half, we should have a good safety margin all around. Absolutely. I hope we can save most of that kidney. Six-year-old Kyle has traveled with his mother to Toronto from Quebec, where his family lives on a dairy farm. A little chilly, eh? He was born with a malformation on his lip and cheek. We need to go up one more. Today, Kyle will have a procedure to block the blood supply to his lip. He will then undergo surgery to correct the malformation. Did you have anything to eat or drink this morning? No, I didn't eat anything. I didn't Good boy. Anything. Okay, so we'll give you a drink through your vein when you get in there. Give me a big breath. Come on. I see that smile. Okay, I'm just going to listen to you breathe. Good fella. Do you have brothers and sisters? Only brother. Does your mom not have any girls? No. 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 All the boys. Hi, Kyle. Can you come over here for a second, Kyle? Let's just have a quick look. Come over this way. Good. Cooperation, remember? Same size as before, right? Okay, you can go play now. Him. What could or what would happen to him if nothing was done, if he was just left to live his life with his lip malformed like this? I'm not sure if Kyle is self-conscious about it now but he probably will become self-conscious about it as he grows yeah, older. And that's just what I was thinking of. Like, when they're, like I have two teenagers at home now. The girls are getting very popular at my house now. I see what my older sons are having, and I didn't want yeah. Kyle to miss out on that. They like That's such an important part of life, eh? like that first kiss and everything else. These are some of the films from the last angiogram I did. As you can see, the blood supply is quite rich are quite yeah. intense yeah. and what I want to do is to take away that blood supply it's a pre-surgical treatment to decrease the blood supply to the uh, malformation so that the surgical reduction of the lip can be much more easy I expect that the cosmetic improvement mm -hmm. will be quite significant okay okay yeah any other questions that you uh, thought of no this is our room he's been in the sleepy head room before where can I put them in there? Three kids, yeah. and you have to go out the door. That's great. Marley is going to show you a good care. Okay, thanks. Okay, that great. was really great. <laughs> you want the spot on you, or the rest of the I don't mind. Uh, it's, it's, yeah, the spot is good where it is. Okay, this is the left external carotid. You go lateral, please. Nobody else 
Leslie, I need to send this up to pathology, please. I need them to look at the uh, margins. So we're in good shape with this girl, I hope. As long as her kidney doesn't form more tumors on us, we should be in great shape. All right, I'll go talk to her. Well, we're all done. Things went well. They're just um, waiting her up now, and she's breathing on her own, so things went really well. The right kidney didn't look like we could remove enough tumor and leave enough kidney functioning tissue that, that would make it worth her while. So we ended up removing the right kidney completely. And then, and then we went over to the left side. We defined together what part of the kidney needs to come out and then removed that front wall of the kidney. Her kidney that she does has, it's the same size as it was before. It's just missing the front, the front part of it. Right. OK. And it should function normally, you're hoping? And it should. There's a chance that it will leak some urine where that raw surface is. But otherwise it should, yeah. She should have good function from that remaining part. So now she'll be able to finish her chemo treatment? And well, I'd like to wait a few days. I mean, yeah. we're not going to jump no, in. We'd no. like to give her a chance to heal a bit. It'd be hard to start chemotherapy if the kidney's not functioning well. And then we'll take it, you know, as, as it comes after that. Yeah, it's been a day by day. Yeah. We'll All right. Thank good. you so much. We'll be fine. Thank you. Okay, guys. Take care. Thanks. Good, Emo. It's still not over. We spot this now. We can fight the cancer. She's cried a little bit. Oh, has she? Mm -hmm. She doesn't open her eyes, though. No. Oh, sweetie, mommy's here. I just want to see what they did to her. Let's see what they She goes across here. She's a drain here. In the cup here. Hello. Oh, baby girl. So strong. Hey, you gonna wake up for daddy? Hey. Kyle's mommy, do you want to come in? Yes, here? yes, I do. Okay. He called for mommy. Kyle. Hi. Hi, mom's here. Can you hear me? Want to have a little sleep? Okay, I'll let you sleep, okay? Okay. How are you guys doing? Hi, Dr. Phillips. How are you? Yeah, I talked to Dr. Armstrong, mm -hmm. and uh, he was very happy that he was able to knock off um, the main arterial blood supply to this yeah. so that um, if we do surgery tomorrow, the risk of bleeding is much, much lower. We'll err on the side of caution in terms of how much we'll take out to avoid any injury to the nerves or mm -hmm. uh, the muscles to his face. This is what we've been waiting a long time for, eh, Kyle? I don't want to do it like that. No? Well, how do you want to do it? I want to go home. You trust Mommy to do what's best for you? No. Kyle, you do too. <laughs> you do too. How are you? Yeah, good, fine. Did you have a good night? Yes. Yeah. Exhausted and relieved that she got that, still got a kidney in her. <laughs> yeah. She's done very well overnight. Uh, kidneys continue to make good urine, fortunately. I'm very happy about that. And uh, it looks nice and clear, nicely dilute, so. Okay. Um, You're just like my miracle that I prayed for when you were operating on her, because we is. just didn't know what to think, you know. And, this is so scary and... So, we're in good shape. I think we're in good shape. Yeah, there's a bathroom downstairs, remember? Don't throw Sam. Sam didn't do anything wrong. Watch it. Oh, Kyle, you're gonna get a little sleepy, okay? 
Can your mom's going to stay with you. No. You want to play that game? Okay. okay, so let's see if we can lie him down. So just lie him down, okay, Kyle? Okay. 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 Here's your monkey. Here's your monkey. It's just your monkey. It's just monkey. It's just monkey. Scared. Can we walk out? But he's gonna be fine, really. What we'll do is we'll come out. I'll come out as soon as we're done. got some urine leaking out of the drain which is not unexpected that's okay I mean we it's once you cut across the kidney in that way you've got the kidneys like a little sponge and you've got so many little holes in it and it's impossible to seal them all off so then what I'd like to do is just put a stent up in that uh, through the bladder up into the kidney without surgery just with the scope so that we divert the urine and encourage it to come down through the catheter that's in the bladder and the sooner we can get her urine diverted out the faster she'll heal and, and get back on her chemo, etc. Yeah, okay, that's yeah. the most important thing. Yeah, very good. Okay. Thank you. All right. Have a shot. You see the, uh, the spiricalysis? Yeah. There it is. And there's your leg. Spiricalysis? Yep. Let's push it more. Yeah, that's perfect. So, everything went perfectly. Okay. So, we put the. You see here? We put the catheter inside. And how long will this be left in her? Oh, this we will keep it uh, at least nearly three to four weeks. When that drain here will start to give less urine, we're going to remove it. Is that okay. going to hurt her? No, this not, really. She'll be happier to, without it. I think it will be really good. Yeah, well, that's great. I Thank hope you. so. Okay, <laughs> bye-bye. Bye. 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 Have they given anything for discomfort? or? Yeah, I don't know. She had something in the She looks so pale. She does look pale. I'm just wondering what her counts were because... Looking pale is not good, Kala. No, what we're doing is... Um, we try to identify normal anatomy. In this case, you really want to preserve his muscle that allows him to open and close his mouth. It's not as vascular as we would have expected. And obviously it's because Dr. Armstrong yesterday did a good job in embolizing it. It's really starting to swell. Yeah. It's looking good though. Went well? <laughs> I hope, despite some swelling you see now, you're going to see a nice change. Mm -hmm. you'll, get a, you'll get a general idea of contour. Oh, I'm anxious to see him. <laughs> and, uh, but unfortunately, overnight, he's really going to swell. Yeah. There's no question. And then hopefully over the next, probably by about three to five days, swelling will start to go down. And as you said, it'll be over the next couple months, we'll start to see the, the real change. But I think it's going to be worthwhile. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs> All right, Thank I'll you. see you later. Okay. Hey, somebody's hiding their face. How are you? Poor <laughs> Kala.
I think we're, I'm, I'm happy with how things have come along. Good. Yeah, so we're going to take the drain out now. Yeah. And um, from a surgical standpoint, I think we'll be done. Done? Yeah. Oh. yeah. So that's great then. Hey. <laughs> no Fine. Yeah, that's great then. All right. Thanks. Good. I don't know how long it's going to be, but this part's all going to be flat. Yeah. Okay, all done. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Jeez. Hi, Kyle. Mom's here. It's okay. It's okay. Mom's here, okay? Yeah. He was so terrifying, the poor guy. Yeah. Oh, I gotta get out of me. I'll get your chair. <laughs> no, it's okay. okay. <laughs> Just, you sure? Yeah. <sighs> Kyle, you know it's all over now, eh? Okay. And you feel good about it? Good. <laughs> good. Is he swollen up? Yeah, he's swollen, yeah. Oh yeah, he's really going up. After six years of seeing that lip out, the first thing I said, oh my god, I had to get on my knees, I thought it was going to drop. Yeah, it's gone. The lip is gone. Yeah, it's going to be amazing, I think. Yeah? I'm hoping, yeah. Okay, we'll see you tomorrow. Okay, thanks. Hello. How are you? Good. Impatient. Impatient for what? Well, just nervous to hear what's happening. Well, um, it's pretty good, the right kidney. Uh, this thing that had grown, it's not clear why it had grown, because there's very little tumor in it. This was not a growing tumor. Yeah. Great. Oh, that's so good. And while she's on chemo, no more going to come on that one kidney that's left, eh? It shouldn't. Now, you know, can I write you a guarantee? No. No, um, I know that's the way this But is. I think that with the addition of a more powerful, more stronger chemotherapy the chances of it recurring in very small so you will get touch with me when everything starts and yeah we'll just keep track of what's going on so that's good we'll keep in touch. <laughs> okay thanks oh. thank you <laughs> no fake and no take a real drink <laughs> <laughs> oh <laughs> that's it <gasps> <gasps> oh, you're too smiley fuckers. You're just too smiley. I think that's the most you drank in one day, Kala. At least she's got the glasses to protect her eyes from the straw. Beautiful, <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Good morning, girl. some fluid through and then I'll push the medicine in and then push some more fluid through to make sure it gets to her. Big yawn. It's gonna be over before you know it. Do you remember where the clinic is? So? What do you think? You think it was worth going through all that? The girls think so. Eddie mm -hmm. sure likes it. Hey. Right? Take a peek at you. <laughs> can I can I touch it a bit? I'm not gonna hurt you, okay? Uh, no, is that still swelling? Yeah, or? he's still got a little yeah. swelling. But I think he's made a nice change. Oh, I think it's a great change. Kyle's surgery has been a success. He will be seen by doctors in six months to determine if additional work can be done to further reduce the malformation in his cheek. But Kyle is very pleased with the change in his appearance. Hi, Kyle. Sit down. She's doing very well, aren't you, Kyle? What are you up to? Sit down. You're going to fall. I think maybe you should get out of the way before you fall. You see, she's feeling better, definitely. Oh, yeah? 
<laughs> yeah. But we're gonna be going Friday. Yeah. We still get to yeah. go home yeah. Friday. All right. <laughs> so, so she's all done now for blood work. And yeah, she's had some bloods this morning. There's no need to do any bloods tomorrow. Oh, she, can, she can go home. Oh. Very oh. oh. nice girl. Oh, give me a kiss now. Oh, she wants to give you a kiss. After a month-long stay, Kala is ready to leave the hospital. She will continue chemotherapy treatments at a hospital in Sudbury, near her home. Bye. Bye. Thanks for everything. Doctors are hopeful that her future looks positive. <laughs>